when I date outside my race. I don't think people outside of my race are attracted to me because I give very much like black girl. Like, well, what do I give? Well, Gina, you can give very much like. First, I'm gonna say something. <laughs> y'all this is your girl d and i'm back for another episode of real tea with d you already know this is your favorite youtube channel for all of your favorite youtuber gossip the ones that they talk about and the ones that they don't and child we finna get into this whole little messy situation with this podcast because you already know it looked like to me and everybody else that gina was the main one getting asked all these questions so y'all let me know how y'all feel about this in the comment section below but first topic we're gonna get into is your girl lily lee wants a leah honey now baby when i tell you if lily has some questions she asked every single question that she had honey and i don't know if it came from the people in the comments or if they was just questions that she had but yeah when i say she didn't ask every single question that i could think of and at the end of the day every time she asked she looked straight at the so source uh, the people seeing facial expressions and they was like, oh, them bitches ain't your friend, they ain't this. And I'm saying like... Now, child, these friendships is definitely a topic that we chimed in before on, especially on our life, honey. And you already know about them looks. Yes, them looks, baby. They will definitely throw you off. So y'all let me know about how y'all feel about them looks in the what comments. What y'all feel about my situation? Now, baby, Portia face is acting like she's trying to act like she don't understand what's going on here. And she do. She do. <laughs> what, 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 what is that situation you talking about? Just, just all of it. Right. You know the situation. Right. <laughs> child, not Gina in the background giving it up, talking about some, you know what she talking about. Honey, that's definitely giving. You know what she talking about because we be talking about it. So, girl, I don't know. Know what you thinking but you definitely should have left that little comment alone so moving right along to her your girl gina janine okay so you already know she didn't have some little messy moments in this podcast child. Gonna this, someone gonna say, gina chewing her gum while portia talking so she hates portia <laughs> baby as soon as i seen her stick that gum on the side of that cup i seen portia with the side eye child Wait, that's dirty <laughs> Girl, Lily and Portia was having too good of a time over there kiki and laughing about Miss Gina now child okay i don't know what they be talking about but honey they had so a good when little time my one and only internet beef, which it is not a beef. I want everybody to be very clear of that. It was drummed up by these subscribers, by the trolls. Mm -hmm. There was never any beef, but the other person chose to believe the trolls. And we touched on this in the last video just a little bit. At the end of the day, I don't see why everybody choosing sides. Yeah, they could be the damn same, they could be different. I don't see what the big deal is. I have no idea what the problem is. I don't know about for y'all, but to me, for it to go left like that, just based off craziness from the subscribers, that was so, like, crazy. At the end of the day, it's good to see that Portia didn't choose a side. Because, child, when I say some of y'all be in my comment section choosing sides like y'all at recess like kids at an elementary school, I don't know what be wrong with y'all, how old some of y'all are. But at the end of the day, y'all be talking about me and child. When I say y'all be so damn immature, y'all don't know what y'all supposed to do. Choose a side to be mad at me for talking about these people. And I'm very last minute. Mm, she's like, like, with our birthday trip, my birthday? Wait a minute. Because, wait a minute. Ooh. Because when we talk about last minute, last minute, I'm talking about she could have planned it when our flights could have been no. 500, but they ain't 100. is giving this is how they ended up on that broke down ass sprinter bus for that beyonce concert okay because gina so last minute she probably found that man on instagram or on yelp or on craigslist or something last minute child trying to book that little sprinter bus but at the end of the day they still made a child and at the end of the day she still made it on the trip so i guess she wasn't that last minute for this one moving on to the next topic which is the girl glamazante what do you feel about people having a relationship with a person that might have a problem with you how do you feel about friends that still friends um or associates with people that to like don't like you or you don't like now baby when i say lily asked that same question two times in two different ways and both times she asked that question she looked straight at gina i don't know why child y'all tell me asked me about my, one of my old friendships which is me and tay and i see a lot of y'all comparing like my friendships right now to me and tay and me and tay was what are you saying Child, Jenna trying to act confused like she don't know people be comparing these friendships, okay? You already know they comparing the friendships. They talking about you supporting Tay and they talking about their friendship, child. Ain't nothing wrong with it, but at the end of the day, you know, they you like, know. Oh, I, um, I like you and Tay better or I like y'all vibe better. At the end of the day, what I will say is I enjoy Lily's friendship with both with Glamazante and I enjoy her friendship as well with Gina and with Portia. But at the end of the day, there were two different vibes. But at the end of the day, like I said before, and one of the subscribers also mentioned that I think that Gina is refraining from the friendship with Glamazante because she don't want to have uh, Lily feeling no type of way. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about that in the comments. Now moving on to Portia Nicole because at the end of the day, child, we already know this girl do not be telling her business. So why we know it now? Who? You know what this is? No. Zoom in on this. Zoom in on this. <laughs> Now, baby, look, Portia don't even want us to know who the hell this man is, let alone child that she might be engaged, okay? So I don't know what the hell Gina done told us her business for, but she can keep her business herself and tell it on her own. outside of my race are attracted to me because I give very much, like, black girl. Well, what do I give? Well, Gina, you can give very much, like... Portia, want to say something. <laughs> <laughs> I give mean, bad. I don't think I'm much. Bitch, what do I give? What do 
pretty much says she feel like Gina is giving drug dealer, rapper, basketball player. Mm -hmm. Gina done damn near at the end of the day done said herself she might be giving side chicks. So at the end of the day, that's what you giving, honey. That's what you giving. Can't nobody help it. But I do enjoy Gina and Portia's friendship. They are definitely giving big sister and little sister. I like how they laugh and kiki with each other. So I like to see that friendship grow and keep seeing these ladies together. Moving on to the last topic, which is the whole group as a whole. Portia Nicole, Lee Wantalia, and your girl Gina Janine Chow. Child, like I said, when Lily has some questions, what she do has you some questions. about like somebody close to you or your friends like having a group chat about you and discussing your shit? Like, what do you feel about that? And discussing your shit? Baby, when I say every time Lily had a tough question, a tough question, that hair sure did shift Gina away. Y'all tell me in the comments what y'all think that's you know the situation. Right. <laughs> now, like I said, that you know the situation was definitely given. We done talked about this before. I don't know who should be on the phone with y'all. I don't know if it's Portia or if it's her friend Jen. But at the end of the day, it sounds like they definitely done discussed this before. So y'all let me know how y'all feel about that in the comment section below, child. But it was definitely given. We have spoken about this. To end things off, I definitely enjoyed this whole little podcast situation. I like their vibe. I like their energy with with each other it was really nice seeing them laugh and enjoy each other's energy and be open and honest with each other because that is definitely what friends are for a child and i see that they are friends enough to be open and honest with each other so i can't argue with that child but at the end of the day you know these vacation vlogs is coming up so let's stay tuned for that and lily's birthday child is coming so let's stay tuned for that too this week's shout out goes to my girl LaShawn Jenkins. Thank you so much for always being in the comments and always coming and talking to me and giving me the tea, girl. You know, I appreciate you because we always go back and forth. And that is what it's all about is getting these friends and keeping them together, child. I appreciate you. Make sure y'all send some purple hearts in the comment section. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. If you want to see any of the videos, well, the video that's linked in this video, make sure you head over to my description. It will be linked below. Make sure, like I said, you hit that notification bell so that you don't miss a new video. And we will be back for another Friday Night Live. So don't miss out, child, because it's going to be late, okay? It's definitely going to get a little messy and a little interesting, child. So you do not want to miss it. I will see y'all on Friday. Peace.